Vladimir Horowitz has been called the great magician because of the incredible range of color he produces from an ebony and ivory keyboard. Watching him play is seeing genius witness its own talent. He does not just play the piano, he caresses it. Horowitz has been honored by presidents and princes four years ago playing a command performance at the White House. This weekend, he was lured back to Europe for his first concert on this side of the Atlantic in more than 30 years, and he was greeted like a monarch restored to his throne. Sir John Tooley, general director of the Royal Opera, called it one of the musical events of this century. I mean, here is a giant amongst musicians, a giant amongst pianists, who after 30 years' absence has decided to come back to London. combination of technical brilliance and musicianship produces these incredible results. Music lovers paid $200 a seat and more to hear that brilliance and they were charmed with music that crept into their ears with a soft stillness and then rose to a voluptuous swell as the great master teased music from the soul of his Steinway. It was Prince Charles who persuaded Horowitz to perform at this recital, which included pieces by Scarlatti, Chopin, Schumann, and Rachmaninoff. And in the words of one critic, it was the next best thing to a god coming down from Olympus. Walter Rogers, ABC News, London.